Hi my friends, welcome back. Let's continue testing ACMD component. In this video, I'll show you how to test MOSFETs. Of course, all type of MOSFETs. Three terminal MOSFETs, eight pin MOSFET or switches, power MOSFETs or flat MOSFETs, and the big three terminal power MOSFETs. So make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell to stay updated. Of course, this is part three. And for those who didn't watch part one and part two, all links in the description. So let's get started. So first, make sure you select the diode mode on the multimeter. So let's test first this kind of MOSFET. As you can see, three terminal MOSFET. So always for this kind of MOSFET, we have here the gate, drain, and source. Gate, drain, and source. The MOSFET could be N channel MOSFET or P channel MOSFET. I'll show you everything. So let's check this one here first. So the red probe here, okay? On the drain, the black probe on the source, we get nothing on the multimeter. Means what? Means this MOSFET is N channel. The proof, when I swap the probes, this time the black probe here on the drain, the red probe on the source, we get a reading about 0.2 drop voltage. In this multimeter, I get 200, means 0.2 drop voltage, means this is a good MOSFET. So let's check this one here also. So one probe here, another here, same ready, means this is N channel. Why? Because the red probe, as you can see, I put it here on the source. And the black probe, as you can see, on the drain, and I get a 0.2 drop voltage, means this is N channel MOSFET. But don't worry, I'll show you also other P channel MOSFETs. Okay, let's check this one, the last one. So one probe here, another here, I get the same ready, 0.2 drop voltage. Also, this one is N channel. So let's see another motherboard and look for P channels just to understand 100%. Okay, guys, let's check this MOSFET over here. So here we have basically the drain. So let's put the red probe on the drain, the black probe on the source. We get already 0.3 drop voltage. Means what? The red probe on the drain, the black probe on the source. Means this is P channel MOSFET. Okay, now guys, we reach the most important used MOSFETs in recent motherboard. Basically, this kind of MOSFETs or switches, HP MOSFETs are the most used and powerful MOSFETs that you can find in every board. Please, before diving into the course, we'd like to give a huge thank you to the sponsor for this video, PCBWay. PCBWay offers many services, ranging from PCB production and assembly to 3D printing and a variety of materials. CNC machining, sheet metals fabrication, injection molding, and more. PCBWay makes it easy to get custom parts for your product. Project. And if you don't like to work a lot with a soldering iron, they can even assemble your PCBs for you. That's the PCB way. Now back to the video. Just a quick explanation for beginner. Here these three pins are for source. Here we have the gate and the four pin here are for drain. Of course, we have this dot here and this white mark means this is the pin number one. Always for this kind of MOSFETs, pin number one, two, and three are for source. The pin number four is for the gate, and the other four pins are for drain. So we can even check using the multimeter, as you can see here, these four pins, as you can see, are connected together. Okay? So just for beginner, this is drain four pins connected together. And these three pins here, as you can see, are also connected together. Why? This is the source, but the fourth one, not connected to these pins over here. The same also for 
this MOSFET for pin here are for drain okay here we have source and we have the drain so how to test this kind of MOSFETs easy always the same working principle so between source okay you can put the probe everywhere here in every pin here in source so between source and drain you have to get a drop voltage here we get 0.2 drop voltage means this is a good MOSFET once you didn't get a short like this means the MOSFET is good the same for this one also here let's check we okay so here we get upload so we have to swap the probe so the red probe here in the drain the black probe on the source okay we get 0 0.2 drop voltage it means what it means this MOSFET is good and what is the type of this MOSFET once I put the red probe on the drain and the black probe on the source and I get a drop voltage means the MOSFET this MOSFET is P channel MOSFET why because the red probe on drain and the black probe on the source okay my friends what about this kind of mosfets please those mosfets are very important we find it in every board especially desktop motherboard okay this is a three terminal mosfet or some technicians called it a four terminal mosfet because we have the drain here and also here so this small pin here is connected to this pin we can even check if I put one probe here this is drain and another probe here you see we get a continuity why because those terminals are connected this one is drain this one is drain so gate drain also this one drain and source the same working principle if I put one probe here another here I get one drop voltage means this is a good MOSFET I can just put one probe here in this pin because also this one is drain another here I get the same reading 0 0.1 drop voltage means what means the MOSFET is serviceable so this is the end of part three guys i hope that you understand please don't forget to subscribe hit the notification bell for upcoming videos of course part four will be tomorrow or after tomorrow just be sure you hit the notification bell for alerts thank you very much and please don't forget to like the video and for anyone who wants to access learning, you can join my Patreon page, all links in the description. Thank you very much and see you in part 4.